This is the Hyperloop, capable of reaching the speed of sound with zero emissions. It consists of a tube designed to generate very low air pressure and a pod which travels through it. Since 2016, Elon Musk and his company SpaceX have been running the Hyperloop pod competition, where universities and high school teams compete to design and build the pods that will run on the Hyperloop track. So what, what this is really intended to do is to encourage uh, innovation in, in transport technology. May the best team win. More than 100 teams entered the pod design competition. One of the success stories is Hyperloop UPV, a team of students from the Technical University of Valencia. UPV has done great in this competition so far. In 2016, we won two prizes. We won the best design and we won the best propulsion subsystem award. For this year's competition, the criteria the teams will be judged on is maximum speed and controlled deceleration. The updated rules require that each competing pod is self-propelled. We are preparing for this competition and building a new pod, four times as powerful as the past one, but this time we are uh, focusing on speed. We are talking about 400 kilometers per hour. The main challenges that we have is the wheels, because uh, there like, have to be specific wheels. We are reaching really, really high temperatures. With such an ambitious design project, there are a lot of obstacles ahead. Engineering firm Altran is on hand to support the team. This is a big project and of course we have several technical challenges. For example, in levitation, structures, materials, uh, control systems and so on. The team are working round the clock testing all the key components of their pod, which they hope will propel them to victory. The team is right now testing uh, the propulsion mechanism, the braking system, the electrical system, because in two months' time, we have to be able to build and integrate all of this technology into one pod. There are a lot of talent in the world, and there are great teams with a lot of resources, but I've seen that in Spain, in UPV, they, we have the, the best team.